Oh, baby, have I got some things to show you for them Godzilla fans out there. Let's go. Greetings, friends. Let's talk Godzilla. I saw something that I just wanted to share with you guys. Many of you who've watched my uh, episodes or series or whatever you want to call these things on YouTube have seen my Godzilla collection in the background. And while I'm not like the world's greatest collector, and I know I can distinguish one Godzilla from another, I'm not going to be able to tell you like what's the most valuable Godzilla. I can just show you I've got like cool stuff i think like big boy godzilla say hello big boy look at this big boy big chunk big old chunky godzilla coming around look at him he's a cool guy so i like this godzilla it's cool godzilla and uh you know that's like a newer godzilla i think i got it from like a walmart or something and then i've got like this old school super old chunky leg godzilla sam he's a good guy Supposed to light up. I haven't changed the battery, but like, I don't know if he's from Heisei era or or what have you, but I got some cool Godzillas. And what I wanted to show you guys is uh, something I saw on my YouTube feed because I liked and subscribed to something, especially Toho. So make sure you like and subscribe if you want to see a little bit more about this. And maybe one day if I get enough likes on this and you guys are interested, I'll show you my Godzilla collection. I know normally we do comedy and reviews and stuff, but I just I couldn't help myself. I saw this. It's a great deal. It's only for a couple days. So without further ado, let me show you here. Ooh, look at old school 1954 Godzilla. And I've got my little happy Godzilla bouncing in the corner because he was so happy he wanted to join us. So let's take a look. We're at the Toho USA shop. Um, I guess what happened, I used to get a lot of my Godzilla stuff, I guess from, uh, you can go online and you can find some of the rare stuff, but you got to go on eBay and things. I was getting a lot of it from, from, uh, Walmart cause they were still selling it. And then I found out that they were discontinuing everything in the U S and I was like, Oh man, you know, every once in a while I like to treat myself to a, a Godzilla guy who can hang out with me in the back. You know, I've got a lot of friends back there. Um, but then I saw this this Godzilla shop that opened up now and uh it's pretty cool <laughs> I'm pretty excited grow your official collection I most certainly will and apparently this is uh you get 15% off your first order through July uh through through September 24th today is the 22nd or 23rd so you have a day or two if you catch this a little bit later you won't get the discount, but it's still a great place to go. I cannot tell you how many like gems that are on here that are just like impossible to. to I've never even seen some of these. Like this Hedora figure, it's nineteen ninety nine from Final Wars. I know he was in the movie for all of like five seconds. It's got like a one minute scene, but come on, people, it's like a what's he a six inch vinyl. Yeah, six inch vinyl, pretty dope. I pr it probably comes in. A, I take everything out of the box. See, I'm not, I'm not that kind of collector. <laughs> I want to see my toys. <laughs> Look at this freaking Mecha Godzilla Kiryu. He doesn't have the blue guns. Like I said, I'm not, I'm not like the greatest collector in the world, but I know what I like, and I like me some Mecha Godzilla. That's <laughs> pretty dope. Look at that six inch vinyl. He'll look real good. Maybe sitting up on my shelf. Maybe yours too. You just got to take a look. Like this stuff is just, it's so cool to see some of this stuff. They're like impossible to get some of these things. I've never even seen them. There's a couple cool Godzillas. I'm like, I'm not like the world's biggest fan of like the, the Millennium Series Godzilla, but like you can get them. It's cool, whatever. He's got his purple big fins. Don't, it's not, I'm like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of that Godzilla. And I've got, look, I got, I got OG Godzilla. What do I need anybody else for? My boy right here. It's my boy Blue. He's right here. He's with us. Uh, but we could take a look. Uh, like this, I have this. I have this Destroya. It's hard to come by. He's up there. 
20 bucks. Not too shabby. And there's like some real wild stuff too. Like, I don't even know what this is. Bear Brick Godzilla versus Destroya. Uh huh. <laughs> Whatever. Like, I've never seen, I don't even know what that is. It's cool though. Now they have some super crazy collector stuff, which is like this giant Kiryu, like, yeah, I'm not paying, like, look at this, it's 275 bucks. But like I said, for super collectors, you know what I mean? Like, look at these cute little plushy guys burning Godzilla. Come on, with a zipper mouth, don't even know what that's for. But I just thought all of this was super duper cool. And uh, there was one or two things I saw that I, you just like can't get anywhere. I've never even seen. Uh, now, this is expensive, but we talked about this probably in my Gamera review here. Uh, yeah, we've got a, a Jet Jaguar from Godzilla Singular Point. Are you kidding me? Look how cool that looks. It's freaking awesome. He's got his little helicopter jet pack. Now it's a, it's $105. But it's pretty freaking cool. I just, that's pretty awesome. And uh, some of it's pre order. Some of it you can order now. Like, yeah, I would love King of the Monsters Ghidorah. That would be amazing. But yeah, I'm not dropping 230 bucks on it. But the choice is yours, my friends. The choice is yours. You can get the whole collection, the 54 to 75 collector set pretty dope this um what's the other there's like two more things that i really really like that i might add to my collection i have this retro gigan that tell me that looks like hot rod cool look at that so that's pretty wicked i like that a lot need to get me maybe that guy too might maybe i'll well if i get them if i can afford them i will get them uh, but I just think these are like super difficult to get. Like I've never seen, you know, I've probably got like 30 figures up there and I've never seen some of these characters. And I think it's probably, you know, it was really difficult to buy stuff from Japan. And look, I'm just a, a normie Godzilla guy. Like I'm not some super Godzilla freak. I just like Godzilla and I like him sitting on my back. Just like I, I, I have my at at sitting back there. It's pretty cool too. Check this out. The movie series Hedora, chocolate color. Come on. Don't get much cooler than that. That's wicked. You get this gold edition Hedora. Who? Come on. That's pretty. That's freaking awesome. Okay. What else is cool? What else is cool? Uh, oh, here's one. I've, I've literally never even seen one of them i've seen a bunch of toy guys who had godzilla collections and i've never seen this megalon retro color edition i mean it's pretty cool but i've never seen one so you know even like a look at this a super like super mecha godzilla six inch vinyl come on man it's a japan store exclusive i can't buy it. can i buy i could buy it see I think you're getting access to the Japan store. So this just is all super cool. There's a glow in the dark King Hedorah. Come on, man. That is awesome. Two, so much of this. It was a San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. You could buy it for $25. What? What? <laughs> I can't, like, it's just so cool. And I guess they come in the box. I don't know, man. It's pretty cool, though. I'm super tempted to get that guy. So many cool things. Uh, it's just it's just wild. I, I've never seen... I'm excited. I think uh, we should take advantage of this. Show Toho our love. They're coming out with a new Godzilla. Uh, Godzilla Minus One. And it's, it's obviously a Japanese one. For those of you who didn't have never gotten... If you like the US King of the Monsters Godzilla ones... Shin Godzilla is one of the best Godzilla movies ever made, hands down. From the creators of uh, uh, Evangelion, with the Neon Genesis Evangelion. Uh, he, he was one of the co-directors on it. But yeah, it, it's cool. They're, they're going to show it in U.S. theaters too. I'm very excited about that. So 
just wanted to share. I was like, this is pretty cool. It's not something I usually do, but I thought I would share it with you guys. Again, leave some comments. I'll share the rest of my collection if you find it interesting. I would love to talk to any of you collectors. We can have a conversation. Like I said, I'm not like some sort of super collector. I'm not going to tell you everything. I don't know everything, but I just know I've got some cool, fun guys. They wanted to come on camera, say hi. Say hi, Godzilla. Yeah, see? Just nerding up some nerd stuff, guys. And I uh, wanted to share. So if you like this, be sure to tune in to our podcast. It's more of a comedy show. But uh, I'm sure you'll find some things interesting as I do it with my co-host. And we like to party. So you bring the party. We live stream it here on YouTube, 9, or 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's like 9.30 Central, whatever you want to <laughs> whatever you want to do. We also have an audio podcast of that same stream, which you can catch on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify. We're going to have episode 316. Come catch us. It's a lot of fun. Promise. But as for me and my mate Godzilla, we own to the next one. Mm -hmm.